Hi, everyone, and welcome to Episode 8 of Rampant MVP. We are Sean and Steph, owners and operators of Rampant Design, and today we are here to talk about the how, what, when, where, and why you would use glitch effects in your video production. We get a lot of emails about what are glitch effects, when do I use these glitch effects, where do I use these glitch effects, and of course, how do I use these glitch effects. So let's talk all things glitch effects. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's start with the what. What are glitch effects? Well, a glitch is a type of malfunction that can occur in things like video, games, audio files, and photographs. These glitches can be recorded and the resulting files are glitch effects. Glitch effects are designed to add distortion to your video without actually destroying your footage. Okay, well that's really cool. Now that we know what glitch effects are, how do you use them in your video? Well, glitch effects are really simple to use, but you're going to use them differently depending on the editing software you're using. So let's check out how to use these in Premiere Pro, Final Cut, and DaVinci Resolve. Alrighty, in Premiere Pro, you add the glitch effects above your video clip, head over to the effects panel, and change the blend mode from normal to screen. Boom, there's that awesome glitch effect blended right onto your video. In Final Cut, add the glitch effects above your video clip, head over to the inspector, and just like in Premiere, change the blend mode from normal to screen. And again, you will see the glitch effects blend with your video footage. And in DaVinci Resolve, the procedure is pretty similar to Premiere and Final Cut. You add the glitch effects above your video clip, head over to the inspector, and change the composite mode from normal to screen. And there you go. All that glitch effects goodness blended right on top of your good old video footage. Now, feel free to test out all the blend modes available in your editing software. They all produce different effects, and there's some really, really cool ones out there. If you would like to see any of these as detailed tutorials, check out the links in the description below. Mm-hmm. All right, well, now that we know the what and the how, let's talk about the why. Why would you ever use glitch effects? So maybe you're looking to grunge up your video and you're looking for a little high tech grunge effect. Well, that's where glitch effects would come in. It's the perfect distortion effect for that type of video. Yeah, anytime you want to junk up your video, anything you want to give like some kind of an error in transmission, some kind of a weird frequency shift, and just any kind of thing where you want to give like a real sense of, of, of chaos or, uh, or like Stephanie said, a hacker, just any kind of high tech grunge and glitchiness is, is that's basically what it is. It's distortion for your video. So anytime you want to distort your video for any reason, this is the right way to go. Well, that's pretty cool, right? Now we come to the when. When do you use glitch effects in your video productions? Well, like I said just a second ago, uh, anytime you're being hacked, your transmission's breaking through, like pirate signals or distress signals or, you know, pulling the power, shutting somebody down, cutting the power to something, you know, any kind of thing like that, that's the kind of uh, look that you're looking for. Yeah, you can also do mystery or crime dramas mm -hmm. that involve the internet. So again, like hacking or that kind of stuff, any kind of tech show or tech stream, all of these things are great examples of when to use glitch effects. Uh, it's perfect for gaming, gaming montages, gaming clans, opens, uh, you know, any kind of montages that you're creating about, you know, getting the, the scores and whatnot. That's it's or winning the matches. You know, this is great for all of you Fortnite clans out there and everything like that. It's a wonderful way to add a little bit of uh, distortion goodness to your to your videos. And like all other rampant effects, think of glitch effects like a spice. Mm -hmm. Add them whenever you need them for a little extra flair in your video. Just remember, it's not difficult to add effects. It's just a spice. Use it when you need it. And that's it for this episode of Rampant MVP, the how, what, when, and why you would use Rampant Effects in your next video production. If you like this video, please click that thumbs up and share with your friends. And if you don't already have our world famous glitch effects, check the links in the description. They're right down there. And make sure you use coupon code Rampant MVP to take 50% off. 5050. Until next time, we are Sean and Steph with Rampant Design. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye bye.